Hello, welcome to another Dr. Pi tutorial. What are you going to be looking at today then? So for those of you unfamiliar with a hat, it's the thing you can see in the back there. It's the, the blue circuit board. Right, so we're looking at the choice between a Pi Step 2, which works on a Pi Zero even, which would be nice, really compact. It's got the four nice um, sockets there to plug the stepper motor straight in. Wouldn't actually be long enough. The stepper motors I would have to use don't have long enough leads, so I'd still need to extend them. Um, as you can see, it's pictured there, four little 28BYJ48 motors. The leads wouldn't quite be long enough for a CNC or a 3D printer. Looks nice there. I think that's mainly used on small robotics projects. So, that would be option one. I'm still waiting to receive some more components I've ordered and I'll do a final test to see if I do indeed need more torque than the 28 BYJ uh, motors can provide. So next, I've ordered one of these which is on its way. I'm gonna test that because I think it's gonna provide significantly more torque uh, which will be beneficial on a CNC machine for moving the bed. Once that's been checked then I'll know for sure 12 volts gives you uh, yeah 350 milliamps that's fine. Um, this one can be stacked so I can already control two with my current hat which is the same spec as what we're looking at on the technical details here. So if I buy another one with a stacking header, I can have um, two of these. I'd have to power each one, which isn't a problem. I'd just get another mobile phone charger, chop the end off, put one of the nice green and black connector plugs on. Um, so I'd need power for each hat and power for the Pi. So it'd be three lots of power in total, but that's not so bad. The benefit of doing it this way it would be I could have three NEMA 17 stepper motors as pictured here. If you look in the middle then you've also got a fourth motor just a standard DC motor that would actually be the tool so it would be the drill or the router, 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 router however you say it. Um, so the favoured option at the moment is to go for this I'll order it once I've received my next NEMA 17 motor and just tested a NEMA 17 um, from Adafruit on the Adafruit hat and then I'll know for sure that it's the best choice of motor. It all hinges on choosing the correct motor really. Um, but yeah, one way or another, the Raspberry Pi will be controlling four motors. Um, and that's about all I'm going to say on this. So I hope you've enjoyed it. Any advice or comments, please add because um, I'm going into the unknown really with this. So um, yeah, any, uh, any advice, welcome. Thank you.